Hello guys, welcome back to with Trevor Tips and in this video we're going to talk about how to fix OnePlus Open touch screen is not working. So you're having a trouble with the touch screen and it is not working and how we can fix this. Here. So the first one is all about we have to do a restart the device. So like I always used to say in all the video, one of the best solution when you're having an issue with your smartphone, just try with a simple restart before proceeding to any other step. Because a simple restart can fix a lot of issue. So start with a simple restart. And if it's not working, we have to move to the next one. That is all about we have to clean the touch screen. So right now this is the display. So you have to uh, clean it using uh, some kind of very softened material. Sometimes, you know, uh, the debris and the dirts, which may be the reason why you are having the trouble. So just make a, a habit of cleaning it very often. And after the touch screen is completely cleaned, you have to use your phone. I mean, you have to use your hand, you have to can see, and now it is working fine. So sometimes, you know, just clean it up and afterwards the touch screen will be working fine. So you have to do this and make sure that you clean with a very, uh, you know, softened material, not with a hard one. So once afterwards, you have to try. And the next one, afterwards, if it started working, even you cross check these two steps and still the issues there, you can try updating the OS. So just go over here and navigate to the settings. Now from here, we have to keep scrolling down and navigate to the about device and go for the oxygen OS over here and update it. And so after updating the OS, most probably they should be completely fixed up because running on the lower versions can bring a lot of bugs. So it is quite important that we have to be in the latest version. So just update your OS. Once afterwards, still if you are having the issue, we can remove the screen protector. So if you're using any uh, kind of, you know, what you have to say is if you're using any kind of screen protectors over here, you can remove the screen protector because sometimes, you know, the screen protector can be a lot of trouble. So just remove it and afterwards try using it. Even after trying with this, if the issue is still there, you can try going for a factory reset. For this, just tap over here in the settings. Now from scroll down and navigate to additional settings, keep scrolling down and navigate to backup and reset. Just go for reset phone and tap over here in the erase old data. And you have to keep in mind, it will be like a fresh start for your phone. So once after done with this one, so most probably this should be completely fixed. And this is what you have to do. And I hope this video is helpful. And if you find this video helpful, don't forget to subscribe and click on the bell icon for more notification. See you soon in the next video. Peace out. Bye bye.